Okay, so I just got a hankering for a pumpkin spiced latte from the Cracker Barrel. So, let's go get a pumpkin spice latte because I know that is the favorite of a lot of people. I know a lot of people um, just love the pumpkin spice latte. Um, and I'm actually kind of being sarcastic about that. <laughs> but anyway, let's go and check it out. See how their pumpkin spice lattes are. Okay, so I have arrived at Cracker Barrel. I'm doing the curbside pickup. Um, yeah, that's one thing I like about the about curbside pickup everywhere. Um, you can actually just place your order online or by phone, and which I place mine for the pumpkin spice latte. Um, place it online. So, um, oh, it looks like my pumpkin spice latte is arriving. I normally place food orders, but I was in the mood for a pumpkin spice latte. Okay, here you go. And I don't know, I'm um, actually, I've been recording this because I usually um, upload things on my YouTube channel. I don't know if you want to be, I, if you want me to record you or not. Oh, you're fine. Okay. Okay, so here is my wonderful pumpkin spice latte. And this is a very sweet Hi. young lady um, who brought it out to me. And I'm actually. Oh, we didn't have the thin sticks for you, though. I'm sorry. Oh, that's fine. Trust me. That doesn't bother me so thank you so much i appreciate it. you want to say hi to everybody hi. <laughs> thank you i appreciate it. have a good day all right got my pumpkin spice latte and i am so ready to try it out um but anyway um um so like i said cracker barrel pumpkin spice latte and hang on for just a second okay i have not been doing good with my camera angle and i feel bad because uh i did a really bit i did a really bad job with my camera <laughs> angle um with the uh the kind young lady who brought my pumpkin spice latte out but anyway i just want to take the lid off and show you how delicious it looks um, so I'm actually getting ready to take a sip. I gotta take a sip before I even pull out of the parking lot. But look how good that looks. And I do love cinnamon. Okay, so I just took a sip. And it is so hot. Um, and I don't mean by hot and spice. I mean it's hot, um, versus cold. And see, I love my coffee drinks to be really hot. And this one is really hot. And let me tell you. When you think of pumpkin spice, sometimes you think of it being really, really um, oversweet. Well, I'm going to tell you this pumpkin spice is not. It actually is. It's really good. I'm going to take another sip. Mmm. That is some good pumpkin spice latte, I tell you. Um, look, I knocked my cup sideways because <laughs> I, wasn't, I wasn't enjoying it so much. I have not even pulled out of the parking lot yet. I, I probably should pull out... Um, because I am taking up the curbside pickup parking space, but I'm just, you know, enjoying the pumpkin spice latte. And there are uh, other spots here where people can park if they pull up. But, but anyway, i got to take another sip. Oh, yeah, let me take another sip before I pull out of this parking lot. Because i got to enjoy that whipped cream topping along with that cinnamon on top. Mmm. And of course, y'all already know me by now. I have to smack my lips and do a lot of sipping. Mm -mm -mm. Look, fogged up my windows on my car. <laughs> I guess I need to put the <laughs> the pumpkin spice latte up there so it can um, <laughs> um, um, put a little bit of heat up there and don't fog them. Um, but. Probably because I'm so in love with this latte right now, I'm just fogging up the windows. <laughs> yeah, I've enjoyed it. 
Oh, that's good. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know. I might have to sit here in my car and um, drink it before I get home. I might be done with it before I get home. Mm -mm -mm. Let me tell y'all what. This um, this pumpkin spice latte is is actually it's it's really good. And I think the girl that uh, the young lady that brought it out here to me. Um, I think she's the one who actually made it for me, and she did a really good job. Let me tell you that. So Cracker Barrel, this is the Cracker Barrel in Mevin, North Carolina. Um, y'all did a really good job. Okay, so my Camaro, I just had to do this. Um, so my Camaro is happy. Listen. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but my Camaro is roaring happy as well at the thoughts of having his uh, car owner being happy um, so I gotta make my Camaro happy too and uh, when I have my coffee it makes him happy and if I'm happy my Camaro is happy <laughs> okay so i have arrived home um and i think i'm just gonna go ahead and finish out my review of this delicious pumpkin spice latte okay let me tell you after the whipped cream and the cinnamon melted into the coffee slash latte made it even made it taste even better so let me tell you it had a it was a really smooth flavor uh really smooth taste and it was not too sweet that was one thing i like about because i i just uh you know when it comes to a pumpkin spice latte i just don't want it to taste really really sweet and um and i don't know if you remember last year, I think it was last year, I did a review of the pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks. So if I had to choose, I would choose the pumpkin spice latte with the Cracker Barrel. So let me tell you, I, even though the one I got from Starbucks last year was really good, it was really sweet. I mean, it just had, it had a different flavor to it, and it was really, really sweet. Um, but this one, it, it's not. It's not. It's not over, overly sweet, and it's not grainy. I know sometimes when you get certain sweet drinks from um, certain places, they may taste grainy or um, something like that. But the one from the, this pumpkin spice latte from Cracker Barrel is not grainy at all. It's it's really smooth and um, tastes tastes really good to me. So if you're looking just for that, just a hint, basically, a uh, pumpkin spice latte, or pumpkin spice, um, and if you like lattes, uh, then I recommend that you try it. Um, and like I said, they made it very easy. It kind of made me feel like I was doing a curbside pickup from McDonald's. Because, you know, I do place curbside pickup orders a lot of times from McDonald's. And I do it on my cell phone. And, of course, for it, with Cracker Barrel, I did it on my computer. I just placed the order, you know, paid for it in advance, and you select it curbside pickup, and you can even select the time you want to pick it up. And, I, and I, of course, I did. I selected right away because um, I was ready to get going out the door and get my pumpkin spice latte. So and then I pulled up, called, and then they brought it on out to me. So it was really convenient. Um, so I like that. I hope they do decide. To keep this curbside pickup service going because um, more than likely I'm going to probably be getting another um, pumpkin spice latte from there. I have not tried their mochas and I do know that they have those. So at some point um, I may try mocha from there. I know, I know y'all are used to me getting mochas from McDonald's because I love McDonald's mochas. But, you know, I need to give Cracker Barrel a try when it comes to their mochas. All right, well, let me get in the house and enjoy the rest of my pumpkin spice latte while it is still good and hot. All right.
And if anybody else out there tries the pumpkin spice latte or even the mocha from Cracker Barrel, please comment below and let me know what you think about their flavored coffee drinks. And also, I almost forgot this. Please don't forget to subscribe and uh, click like on my video. Um, and because I actually need a thousand subscribers, so I really, really need your help to help me reach a thousand subscribers.